Another young person's been arrested for trafficking, but not in drugs. Debbie Williams tells us about a woman who set up shop at a local motel and what she was selling. Daffy police say guns, cash, and almost two dozen stolen identities has landed a mobile man in jail. The search now for other suspects. A semi-automatic AR pistol, almost $5,000 in cash, and thousands of dollars in merchandise, all purchased, according to police, using stolen identities. Pretty uncommon for us to actually catch catch them in the act, so to speak, and, and get them with this amount of uh, the stolen identities and merchandise and, and the cash to boot. 21-year-old Jerese Shelton now in custody after a week-long investigation that started with the report of a stabbing at the Hampton Inn. When officers arrived, they didn't find anyone stabbed, but they did find some suspicious documents. That led them to call other local hotels. Notified other hotels of the name that was used to check in that room, and we found out that the, at the Hilton Garden Inn, there were currently two guys staying there that were checked in under that name. Inside that hotel room, dozens of items recovered, including driver's license, debit cards, a magnetic strip scanner, three firearms and merchandise, including a $1,000 pair of Gucci sneakers. Identity theft is becoming increasingly common, and police say the best defense is to frequently check your accounts and sign up for any identity theft alerts from credit card companies and your bank completely innocent victims in this, and a lot of them don't even know that they're victims. Shelton currently in the Baldwin County Jail charged with trafficking and stolen identities. On the Baldwin County Beat in Daphne, Debbie Williams, WKRG News 5.